Okay, just about ready. Just take a few more deep breaths. <sighs> <laughs> That's cute. I think he is going to die. Think he's going to die? surgery. <laughs> You're going to take a vote. I don't think you can get him back together. I think she's going to put him back together and he's going to look great. Was... <laughs> <laughs> Miracles do happen. <laughs> was it the wire I'm gonna duct tape them all back together. I don't know. I I had to really take it apart to figure out what was wrong with the soldering in there was terrible. Very good. I bet that whoever soldered that was soldering probably about sixty an hour. Oh yeah, look at that. <sighs> Man, look at that girl go, yo! Oh. You, you had to, you had to put the pa the paddles on him. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, the bill. Well, here. <laughs> <laughs> I missed that. Word. What was the surgery was I a success. The surgery is a sick chest. The sick chicken half like dances way back to you. <laughs> Program. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. All right. 
I take it that we can that we can keep this that's and run it periodically anytime yeah, we want to. It's, that's, well, that's it's, all you. It's more footage. <laughs> More content. It's more proof content. That you, you, uh, you did just what you said you were going to do, and then you sewed him back up. Yeah. Oh, I see. There's, you, there's a little scar. I see the yeah. little scarring <laughs> on the operation. Yeah. He's fully recovered. The stitching is perfect. <laughs> Almost perfect. It's very nice. There, I mean, it's close enough. Mm -hmm. There we go. All right. There you go. Another Christmas gift. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you. There it is. I finally got the. The, the the chicken and it. it's working, mm -hmm. and it, and it's a good one and it plays, it, it eventually get, breaks into the same tune. I'm sure Jonathan loved that part, didn't he? <laughs> well, you know, you can change its hat; it would change his whole thing. Right, you could just pull that hat I off, mean, and glue bunny put a, ears a, on a him, spray, and, yeah, add yeah. bunny ears on him, or <laughs> a farmer hat, you yeah. know, or a, a uh, policeman's hat. We could even put a little hat Top on chicken. this guy. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Being a hat maker, perhaps you'll make a hat. A little bunny hat. But need to have room for his ears to stick out. Well, of course. <laughs> well, that's it. Okay, this is exciting. <laughs> <laughs> also, did anybody watch the election returns last night? We couldn't help it. We yeah, well, wasn't it great that Hillary lost? Yeah. Yay! Huh? What was that? Yeah, wasn't it great that Hillary lost? Well, did you Yay! notice that she didn't even come in second? So that means I heard she, that's what she I'm came, in third. came in third. So that means she yeah. Well, out. you know. No, uh -oh. no like, but the inevitability factor is not there anymore. Yeah, mm -hmm. well, I trusted the American people. That was good. Uh huh. I trusted him. I trusted him last election. I was working the election, and I just uh -huh. got the feeling that, you know, American people are basically pretty good people. So then, you know, the Senate got taken over by one vote. One vote. Yeah. One vote, and then he had a heart attack or whatever. I know. And that, that scared me to death. Mm -hmm. But, I, you know, that just showed that to me. And that, and I was pretty cool. They were, they were all pretty cool people, you know. So, yeah, I thought it was pretty good. I was glad John Edwards came in second. I'm yeah, I like John Edwards. Edwards. Fan. I, like I, John I like Edwards, Edwards I think. I think an Obama Edwards ticket. Would be good. Oh, no, I tell you, I have. I think I've, an Edwards Obama ticket would be good. No, yeah. I've already no, I've I've already I've already figured out what I want to see on the Democratic side. I want to see well on the Democratic side. I want to see uh, the ticket to be um, Obama, uh, Oprah Winfrey ticket, <laughs> and and on and on the. Uh, Republican side, I want to see the um, Huckabee. No, no. Um, Romney. I have enough trouble to try Don't. to say words. Uh, 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 Ron Paul, Ralph Nader ticket. Ah. Uh. <laughs> that would be interesting. He's not a Republican, Ralph Nader. Well, I know that doesn't matter. I don't care. Neither is Ron Paul. They're both independents, aren't they? Well. But but that but that's anyway that's what I want to I don't care that's what I want to see. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't, it is I your right as a I didn't say that any of that was likely to be. I don't I don't. Nobody I like ever wins. So I don't even know that, that uh, um, Oprah Winfrey's even running for anything. You know. I don't what think I mean? she's running. <laughs> no. Is that's this okay. a sassafras stick, John? That is a sassafras stick, and that's that's the grinder yeah. thing to grind it with. Oh, oh yeah, cool! Mm -hmm. yeah, well, that has some of that. So you do it with this, mm -hmm. and just kind of scrape it into your cup. Mm -hmm. ah. You can, or you you can hold that what? over your cup and so, yeah. yeah. Isn't there a sassafras story? Sassafras root story? Sort of. Do you but, know it? Well, no, I don't know. I don't know if the, which one you're talking about. It really doesn't take much at mm. all. Wow, man. Smell that. Mm. Yeah, I got too much on it. Uh, How much is I don't. I don't know. Do, do, I, do, do I know the story, or do you? I don't know. It seems I, to me like we've discussed sassafras before. We've discussed sassafras before. And uh, yeah. you said that you. I remember vaguely something about. You saying something about getting outlawed or something? Yes, or? yes. The 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 um, sa okay. The oil of sassafras. If you get the, take the oil from the root the, from the root bark, the oil of sassafras is seventy percent saffron. And so, and if you freeze it, the saffron is the is the, the there's three oils in there. 
and, and the saffron is the first thing to crystallize out, to freeze out. And so you, you separate it that way and you get the saffron. Then when, uh, then back, back in the day when you could buy real root beer, the, the main flavoring ingredient in root beer was saffron. That's what, so, so, Oil so, of sassafras. so root, root, yeah, the, the taste of root beer comes from the sassafras root. So, so you're now oh. having sort of root beer tea. Do you get too much? No, boy, that's good. You like that? I wasn't sure how much was too much. And, uh, so why did it get outlawed? Well, it was declared a carcinogen. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Thanks a lot. I didn't get too much. I think I'll have some carcinogen in my ah, tea. I honestly don't believe that a little sassafras root in your well, tea is. Uh, well, I, I have to admit that what you believe is not the most important. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, Where'd you get this root? So you're not, so anyway, it's not. Is that a root or a branch? That's a that's, root. That's a root. Boy, that's delicious. And, yeah, and that's, oh no, that's folk remedies and stuff for ages, sass, the sassafras tea. Well, as tea. good as that is, I could drink that all the time. Yeah, and that's what. Uh, that's a delicious tea. Well, yeah. it might not be a bad way to die. But Everybody's got to die. But what, but what yeah. it is. It's better it's, than rotting away in an old folks home. Right. Dying from sassafras I, tea? I don't believe it. Doesn't sound that bad. Yeah. <laughs> I hardly, I hardly believe that a cup of sassafras tea is going to be harmful. No, to I'd you. say that that's that'll cure what ails you. Yeah. So I've uh, got lots of it. You got lots of sassafras growing yeah. on your property. I bet you do. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, around fence rows. And you've not used it for anything. It just grows <laughs> and it's just a no, weed to it's use. Just a pain. Uh huh. Uh, but they, we used to drink it when I was grandmother made it when oh, I was yeah. a kid. Okay. You know, I think mostly for medicinal kind of things. Uh huh. But that was the the, the main. But that you could drink this. The sa the saffron was the was the main uh, flavor ingredient in uh, in root beer, and so. Um, uh, but if you take the um, the saffron, you have to pull it. Pull it. Yeah. <coughs> if you take the saffron and treat it to the same process that's used to make Dutch chocolate. It, hey there. It, makes, it makes 3, 4 methylene dioxyamphetamine hydrochloride, <laughs> a, a, a MDA, which is like MDMA, but one less methyl group. It's a psychedelic. I missed your little piece on my chicken if you, if you treat it to the same, to the same uh, treatment that, that's so used to make Dutch chocolate, if you use the, the saffron instead of the chocolate and run it through the same process, nice. it makes, uh, yeah, a psychedelic. Isn't that something? So that's the story. There we have it. How you Hi. doing, Dr. Black? So glad to see you. I thought I would see you today. Yes, here I am. Right. What's up? You have you have paper. Mount Dungeon entered itself in this today. The North Carolina Visions Project. All right, well. What which is... Uh, it's just uh, locally produced, uh, locally produced video stuff that the best of that we'll put on UNC TV. There, I can get you on camera that way on that camera. See, and you can you, you can. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. We have to work at it. You can move. You can move the co. You, you can move the co-hosts, and you can lean your elbow in on which, that table. Which, which uh, camera is on? That that one. You want me to change the? Hey. To move it a little bit to get him yeah. in. We're sure. full. I Hi there, take a come break. on you in. Want to come in? Bring, yeah, yeah. This, un, 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 unstack those chairs you're on there. Make one for her. Those Here. chairs. I'll, I'll, go, I'll this out. just go step out. No, get him to, get to, to, get to get check. Get him to check it out. At some point. Mm -hmm. Well, you don't have to. Yeah, oh, how share? many people are there? Two. Okay. Mm. And the great thing is, we found about out about this yesterday, and the uh, due date was today. What's that? Uh, All right. Contest to get some stuff on UNC TV. Um, you slide over here as tight as you TV can. It's so uh, public get, TV as opposed to public access TV. Get, get the show is called North Carolina Visions, an independent film series. Okay. North Carolina Visions has had many successful seasons showcasing hundreds of work, works by North Carolina filmmakers. The University of North Carolina Center for Public Television is offering the opportunity for North Carolina film and video makers to have their work shown as part of this exciting series on UNC TV, North Carolina's statewide public television network. The series will also include interviews with the filmmakers. And you can submit up to an hour. So uh, last night, hurriedly, Ben just found two good episodes. 
on one DVD, DVD and I just mailed it off. And That's I'm very excited. Nice. Does that work? You say the, the, the deadline is when? Postmarked today. Postmarked today. So yeah. sending it off today yes. works. Yes. Okay. I just came here from the post office. I see. Yes. I just came from paying my property taxes. Oh, dear God, I'm so sorry. Okay. How outrageously how, has your how, property taxes gone up oh, over yeah. the past few years, no dare I ask? No doubt. Terribly high, but not nearly as high as other areas of the country. Hmm. Have you ever been tempted to just you know, let junk cars accumulate on your property and you like the paint that. peel and things? Haven't you been tempted to find some way you can skirt the system and let things get just dilapidated enough so that your property value goes down? Because, I mean, really, I wouldn't want a high property value unless I was turning around and selling something. I mean, why pay tax? I think property taxes... I hate property taxes. I mean, you know, generally... I'm not like one of these huge anti-tax types of uh, conservative sorts of people, but property taxes, I mean, if you've lived there all your life, you shouldn't have to lose your property because you can no longer afford the taxes on it because rich people are moving well, in. Think, that was the big struggle Scarlett O'Hara had in Gone with the Wind, you know? Got to pay those taxes. Oh, is that so, right? Mm -hmm. That's I, how come she had to do all those bad things? I have the money to pay those taxes. I have to confess that I uh, have never watched more than five minutes continuously of Gone with the Wind. Sort of thing, oh. like my mom would be watching it on TV or something like that, and I'd see it. And You know, I was, of course, a kid at the time, so there wasn't any lasers or robots or anything, so I immediately got bored and went and played. Well, it's definitely not a guy flick. <laughs> no. I would probably appreciate it a lot more now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe you can all squish this way. Or squish it. We can get, we can get some more people in. Y'all might want to split on the other, uh, I don't know. Let's see how does that look. Yeah, yeah, see that will work that way and that will probably work that way. So, there you go. I there managed, we go. Managed look to get, at us. I managed to get most everybody in, sort of. <laughs> Thanksgiving. Yeah. We just don't have a turkey. Well, I